Welcome. Fuck what? Oh shit, I'm being shot at. <laughs> I, I was too busy singing. I hope you put that in, Devin. Oh, oh fuck, that. there's two of them! There's two of them! <laughs> this, is, this is a mistake! Welcome. Oh, how am I alive? I meant, wow. to, I meant to kill myself with that and I'm alive. Alright, roll with it. They don't like your singing, Devin. I used up, <laughs> I used up my only rocket. Well, you live here now. Restart checkpoint. <laughs> I, I totally meant to kill myself with that and I just it did not work. <laughs> so how are you guys doing today? How you doing? You asking them or me? I don't care. <laughs> <laughs> Fucking who cares? Um, welcome. So, off camera we were talking about, um, just like, shitty things we have to deal with at work. <laughs> um, there was like funny shit and stuff like that. Yeah, that's but, right, you better run. But, uh, <laughs> one I didn't say that, I, it's, a, it's a quick thing that I can just like, do, so. A guy wants to come in and, uh, sell some stuff to us. Uh. He's gonna show up eventually. He wants to sell a, a, an old PS2 or whatever. And, uh, this isn't the same j story I told you, Jamie, just so you know. Um, but he wants to sell a PlayStation 2 to us, whatever, like that. And he's like, oh, yeah, yeah I just want to make sure, you know, you guys want it, blah, 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 and stuff like that. And I'm like, okay, yeah, 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 just bring it on by, no problem. And I get a call from him again about, I don't know, an hour or two I later. Fucking hold still! And he's like, he's like, it's an older guy, by the way. So he's like, he's like, oh, I'm at Target, uh, where are you? And I'm like, well, we're on the other side of the mall. So, you're at the wrong, the wrong end. Ends. Yeah, I was like, you gotta come literally to the other side of the mall. And he goes, So, you're not near Target. And I'm like, no. no. I was like, no, no. We're on the other side of the mall by the carousel. And he's like, okay. Is there a bus that'll take me over there? And I'm like, <laughs> I'm like, no, sir. There isn't a bus that goes from one side of the mall to the other. Why do you ask? <laughs> like, <laughs> what mall do you, what malls have you been to where there's a Boss, that's gonna take you from one end to the other. <laughs> the fuck do you think this is? The Mall of America. Yeah, like that's what I'm saying. Like, wh wh what do you want? You want a fucking shuttle? <laughs> what is wrong with you? I was like, no, nah, there isn't. Like, you're just gonna just, just walk on down. Like, <laughs> I don't know what you want from me. <laughs> like, that's what I'm saying. Like, what? <laughs> I was just like so caught off guard by it. I just didn't even like. It took me a second. I was like, "What? What? What did you just ask?" Yeah. I, I have a lot of interesting things like that that just end up giving me that uh that moment where I just like am speechless because like I just don't know what to say. Like that, like that time where like I, get those. I don't I th I I know I've said it on the channel before. I don't remember if it was before your time or not though. Uh, but about your how time. <laughs> uh, BD. Uh, I think it was before Devin, <laughs> um, but it was about how there was a. Yeah, I know, I know, but it's still... made that joke plenty of times. It's it's still the thing though. It's the easiest way to refer to it. It's before I came onto the channel. Yes, but um, uh, it was a mom and like a daughter and stuff like that, and like you know, little girls just looking around, and shit like that. And all of a sudden, you see the daughter, like, and I mean, like, the store is empty. It's quiet. There's like Dude, nothing boy. happening. All you hear is just the TVs playing, playing movie, whatever. And the kids are looking through some shit, and all of a sudden, just loud as fuck, the little girl's like, Mommy, where do babies come from? The stork! And, like, and like all of a sudden, like, me and, the, like, one of the other guys who was working, we just both just, like, just, like, <laughs> look at each other, and we're just like... Where did this come from? Like, yeah, like, what prompted this question? And then, like, we were just like, Is she gonna answer? What's she gonna say? Well, when a mommy and daddy love each other, and, and I think much. she just avoided it. I, I think she was just like, I think she was just like, she just pulled the cord on the question. Yeah, she she just pulled the rip shoot. She was like, I'm out, and flew away. <laughs> but I was like, it was just so caught off guard by like, I just, whenever that shit happens, man, I just don't know how to react. It like takes me a minute to really process it. <laughs> oh, by the way, I finished all the DLC for Fallout New Vegas, so now I have no video games to play again. Ah. Yeah. That's depressing. Yep. Yeah. I'll find something. Maybe. Guys, there's things I can play. I just haven't. Oh, it's down here. I don't know. I'm thinking about Raft. Raft seems like it could be fun. I had someone yell at me because I had to ask their age for fireworks. That's <laughs> dumb. I hate that. Well, I used to have to deal with that all the time when I used to work at a Cumberland Farms. I had to deal with that all the time. People would be like, be like oh, well, uh, I don't have my license on me, but he's 18. And I'm like, well, yeah, yeah but you don't have your... Like that. 
Don't yeah, it's like, that. it's like, yeah, but see, now that you're with him, even if you left and he came back in, I still can't sell him cigarettes because they could be for you. And if you don't have an ID, you could be underage, and then I lose my job. So, no. Yeah, because people don't know how that works. Oh, yeah, fuck, people, I have no ammo People are real fucking now. dumb on that sense. Yeah. I had to deal with that shit all the time. Well, we don't, we don't sell Oh, look at that. Look at him. He's just He's like, <laughs> <laughs> chilling out, Max, and relaxing all cool. Look at him. Dude, he is just fucking chillaxing. <laughs> He's like, yeah, whatever. Building's destroyed, but I'm cool, man. I'm just hanging. <laughs> it's whatever. Yeah. I don't need it. But yeah, the whole underage selling to minors kind of thing. Monica mm. got yelled at because she didn't sell... Uh, like, one person... Two people were there. One person had their ID. The other person didn't. She's she, like, were, she works at, like, a liquor store, convenience store combo. Yeah. For those who don't know. And the, I feel like that was a, a fact we should probably toss in there. Yeah. But, uh, it's they, in Massachusetts. That's the thing you can do in Massachusetts. You can't really do that in Rhode Island. But, but uh, the, these two <laughs> girls came in, and one of them wanted cigarettes. The girl who wanted the cigarettes, or asked for the cigarettes, had her ID. The friend that was with her did not. And so Monica's like, I'm sorry, I can't sell you the cigarettes because your friend doesn't have an ID because it could have been for the friend. Mm -hmm. So she's like, I can't sell you the cigarettes. And this fucking girl went off on her and, and she... God, where? Sorry, it made me nervous because I saw that. Is it, a, is it a tank or is it a sniper? Uh, probably oh, a sniper. wait, wait. Oh, yep, there he ah, is. I saw him right as he fired it, too. Oh, yeah. oh yeah, you Right in your it. ear! <laughs> Did I get it from that? Oh, my God, it was You're his like, ear! I'm a shoot <laughs> But yeah, this, this fucking <laughs> you just girl. Whispered it. This fucking girl goes off on her and she leaves, and then comes back in like five minutes later without her friend. Monica's just like, I still can't sell you the cigarettes. Yeah. I don't know why people. It's like they think we're like NPCs, like we're gonna reset. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> like just because you walked out the door and came back in doesn't mean my mind forgot. Like I've just completely forgotten what happened five minutes ago. Like, but yeah, the, the girl just starts <laughs> screaming at her, calls her the c word, and storms out. And, Mo and Monica. The c word. Yeah. Careless. Yeah. <laughs> But, <laughs> but Monica was just like, yeah, okay, have a nice day. And she's like, you're still a fucking god. And I'm like, <sighs> I'm like, do you not understand how a business works? Yeah, it's, people are, people just. It's like, you're care. going to cost her her job if she sells you those cigarettes. Yeah, no, I agree. That's dumb. I had a woman, we had a sign. The signs in our store always specify this, this, and this is what is 50% off. Yes. No. Yeah. You're very. You got to be very specific about the signs that shit. Are always specific. You have to be. And this woman came up, and we had uh, towels. All towels. Oh look, he's got friends. Oh, squad goals. Yeah, boy. God, what a perfect day for me not to wear sleeves. <laughs> if there was ever a day for me to go sleeveless, it was today. <laughs> was that? Did that? Oh no, it's a reflection of light. I thought it was glowing. I was like, video games have taught me if it's glowing, it's important. <laughs> you found an artifact. This is your family. <laughs> oh, you, but you also got a thing for cover too. I think that's probably why too. Yeah. It just gave you the. Are you playing poker? What's going on here? Uh, examining something. The, the thing said. Oh, fucking Christ. The thing said. Towels. Towels? Bathroom Question bed? mark. <laughs> towels. I think. <laughs> uh, shower curtains, and I think it was like. Oh, bathroom mats or something like that. Yeah. Oh, I never actually started that timer. Towel. That's okay. Yeah, whatever. And so she came up with a washcloth, which is not a towel. That's weird that that's not included, though. That should be included. No, I, it should. Listen, listen. What they what they specify on there is what is included. That's that's the end of that. I agree. However, Why did not, like, hand towels, washcloths, and regular towels should all be included in the same... If you're selling... If you're discounting one, you should be discounting the whole set. I don't know why it wasn't the dishcloths involved with it, but it wasn't. Was it a dishcloth or was it a face cloth? There's a difference. It was a... It was just a cloth. I don't know. If, I think it might be a face cloth. I don't know. But There's a big difference. Is, was it a square? If it was a square, it was a face cloth. It was a square, yes. And it's a face cloth. But the thing is... <laughs> there's, it, a, there's differences. But the thing is, a cloth and a towel serve two completely different purposes. It all depends. Right. A cloth is you, you purposely get the cloth wet to continue getting you wet. A towel is to dry you off. And, but the point is, <laughs> it was not included in the sign, therefore I could not give her the sale. I so, agree. Listen, like I said, the logic there is flawed. flawed because, yes, it should be included in that sale. That being said, though, it if it is not, then no, you cannot change that. And she got so pissed off I had to call a manager to come help me. <laughs> 
Yeah. Because she was pissed off at me, and then she's like, "Well, you should take the sign down." It also depends on uh, it also depends on the kind of systems you use too. Because I mean, like for instance, where I work, there's a little fluctuation of what we can and cannot apply sales and stuff like to. Like it's it's up to our discretion for the most part. Yeah. Well, I, so I this is why I just hate people. If I, am, <laughs> if I, I don't have the authority on the, in the system to change the price of anything. Yeah. I would have to have a manager over. Yeah. Me. Yeah. Exactly. <clears throat> so I don't have the authority to do it. But she comes up and she's so fucking pissed off. She's like, well, should, if the sign's wrong, you should take it down. It's like, like it's not, not wrong. wrong. You're just a fucking idiot. <laughs> if sign's not wrong, you're wrong. Yeah, like you're wrong, like, Colonel Sanders. I'm like, I'm sorry, you can't save the dollar twenty on your dishwasher. <laughs> yeah. Or wash cloth. Well, I'm she's an old lady. Days. That's probably. She wasn't Oh, I think <laughs> she was. I, she wasn't an old lady. Oh, I, I thought you said she was. Oh, uh, did she have a bob haircut? <laughs> no, I did see a woman earlier who had the ugliest bangs I've ever seen in my life. Ooh, there's a wine bottle next to me. Good thing you caught that, because I didn't. Right <laughs> it was really weird. Oh, fuck <laughs> you! <laughs> oh, that sucks. That's bullshit. What a kick in the dick that is. Really? A mission success if I killed that sniper. I, I wanted the wine bottle! I wanted to get drunk. That sucks, dude. I'm sorry. I'm sorry for your loss. <laughs> but... Yeah, like, you know, like, because, like, for instance, you know, we have extremely high-priced action figures slash statues and stuff like that. <laughs> that, uh... And, you know, because of that... I'm angry now. When we do sales, typically those aren't included only because they cost us so much to get that if we discount them... We don't make any money on them, so they're not included in discount stuff, which makes sense. Um, so, you know, like when we do sales, we have to specify, like, listen, this does not apply to Hot Toys, because oh. Hot Toys are like... Alright, what's going on over here? Uh, fucking party, apparently. Hot Toys oh. are like... Is it more Germans against... Where oh, that's Ooh. what's going on! Hot Toys are the action figures you always wanted as a kid. They're like the ones that look 100% like the actors from the movies, and they're like super poseable, come with all the awesome accessories. Like they're fucking amazing, but they're like two to three hundred dollars. Um, they're not cheap by any means, but uh, they're fucking really cool. They're like 12 inches tall, typically. Um, but yeah, like they're really fucking cool. They did one for uh, Terminator, uh, and it was uh, just the Terminator uh, exoskeleton, and it was uh, made out of diecast. Like it was diecast fucking metal, which was pretty fucking sick. But anyways, so like we have to we have to oh. acknowledge that those aren't part of the sales. Oh. Are are some of these your boys? No. These are all Russians and Germans. Oh. They that's blew right. up the tank. Good. One less thing you gotta do. Yeah, but I'm how? What do you mean how? How did they blow it up? Yeah. Grenade or something? Do they have a rocket or something? Mm, not your problem. Of some sort. Yeah, it's not your problem, man. All, all it's I know making, is it's no, it's making care. me nervous because they were strong enough to take down the tank. It was probably just a bull, like you did, like you would do. But uh, yeah, man. Like for instance, we had a superhero sale on Free Comic Book Day, and uh, and like you know we had to decide technically what was and was not superheroes. And for instance, I think Ninja Turtles are superheroes, yeah. so I included them in the sale. Yeah. You know what I mean? I mean, like, they're not comic book superheroes like yes, Marvel or DC. Yeah, they are. I said Marvel or DC. Yeah, but they're still comic book. They were made oh, in comic book first. Well, yeah, I, I know that, but I'm, yeah. I'm talking about like when most people would think of uh, comic book no, superheroes. No, when, when you think superhero, you, you think, think Marvel, Marvel or DC. Or no, DC. No, you're not wrong. I agree, but they are comic book characters and I consider them superheroes. Yeah. Yeah. I have a question. Yeah. Would you consider Deadpool a superhero? Of course. No. Yes. I'm uh, are we are we talking? Okay, well, first of all, superhero also includes supervillains in this sale. That's not the point. He's not a villain, though. No, no, I'm just saying. I'm just saying though. No. He well, he's he's an antihero, but that's not the point. Um, but the no, but this whole thing, the the sale is just you know superhero related stuff. Yeah. It's uh, I just want to make that very clear. It's not just like <laughs> only Batman, no Joker. Like <laughs> no, it's but um. It's just, but it made me think of that. No, yeah. No, Deadpool. Deadpool's an antihero. Like you know, it's same with Punisher. Oh he's, he's my god, boat. he just he got has, fucked he's up. He's not exactly a hero, but he does have all the morals. He's got he's he has morals and he He's more of a vigilante in some cases. He's chaotic good. Yeah. Chaotic good. He said yeah, he's it, well, yeah. he's he's in line with like the Punisher and shit. He's like Punisher, Red Hood, like those kinds of guys where it's like, yeah, they kill people, but they're usually doing it for the right reasons. They usually kill people who deserve to die. 
Yeah, except for sometimes Deadpool just takes on a job to merc somebody. But usually even those, if he's merking somebody, it's for a reason. Yeah, he, he only takes on jobs where it's like he's killing them because they were a fucking prick or, you know, they're doing this, doing that, whatever. Yeah. So, uh, where does that come from? Is that come from... Oh, there he is. Oh, <laughs> you sneaky fucker. Oh, you bitch! Oh! But, yeah, so, no, I, I don't consider him necessarily a superhero, but he definitely isn't a villain. <laughs> you good? <laughs> nope, went down the wrong pipe. <laughs> he, he's, like I said, he's in that gray area with, like, people like Punisher, Red Hood, um, you know, them kinds of boys. <laughs> Can you shoot that Zeppelin? I don't think so. Oh, that's I think it just might be part of the background. Do you know where Led Zeppelin got their name from? A Zeppelin? <laughs> uh, well, kinda. They performed their first, like, <clears throat> like club show or something like that. And uh, they got, like, a review in, like, a newspaper, a magazine or something like that. And, uh... Oh, wait a minute. Is this... Are they the band that opened for another band and uh, the crowd went nuts over them instead of the... Uh, the, the I don't band? know. I don't know if that happened, but probably not, depending if if this... Uh, review is any indication but the review says like oh you know this basically says like this band is terrible they're gonna go over like a lead zeppelin like you know a zeppelin made of lead is not gonna fly like it's just gonna fucking crash and burn and like they were like they were like alright it's like challenge challenge, challenge accepted. accepted challenge accepted they took the name and then they fucking they're big yeah it's fucking Led Zeppelin yeah. yeah it was the same thing as the Beatles like what uh one of the um, there was a producer somewhere. It's like the Beatles aren't going anywhere, and then na yeah, now yeah. they're the they're like the biggest thing that's ever happened. Yeah. yeah, I don't think there's a band that's. I mean, like there's been people who obviously have sold a lot, but I don't know. Beatles, I think, are like probably the most well-known band I'd say. Yeah. <clears throat> I mean, personally, I'm not big over them. They're they're not terrible. No. No, I like. I them. have to be in a very particular mood yeah. to listen to them, though. I am, however, fucking sick and tired of Yellow Submarine. Oh, <laughs> uh, me meta. <laughs> is because of Meadow? No, it's... Because uh, yes. I remember as a kid, I had fucking a record of it. <laughs> just Yellow Submarine. No, Little I'm 45. just... Because it's just like, oh, Beatles, you mean like the Yellow Submarine? I'm like, no! Oh, stop it! Yeah, and it's like, that's like the only song you might know. <laughs> yeah, and like, name any other song! Literally any, yeah. Like, how about, you know, like Blackbird or fucking, you know... Strawberry Fields. Yeah. Like, you know, Across the Universe, anything, like... You're wrong. Uh, you're wrong. <laughs> you're absolutely wrong, Jamie. You are wrong. Now, I'm not saying Aerosmith didn't do yes. a good job. Because they did an amazing job. I think it's awesome. But I've... you can never but you can never credit a cover as being better than the original just because they didn't come up with it. You have to still apply more credit to the person who came up with it in the first place. I That's the way I look at it. I'm not saying you're not applying credit to an amazing song by the original artist. But I don't think that discredits the fact that a cover can be better than the original. Sound Sound of Silence. In my my personal opinion, Disturbs cover of Sound of Silence, in my opinion, is better than uh, Simon and Garfunkel. Also, Holy though, Diver. but here's another thing, though. Hol but, Holy but, Diver by Kill Switch. There's very big differences between those and what we're talking about, and that is genre. Genre plays a huge difference in that because the Beatles and uh, who covered it? You said Aerosmith. Kind of in the same genre, really not that far off from each other, especially like in that, like, you know, come together, like that, no, Helter think... Skelter time. They're all like, it's kind of about the same. Uh, uh, Whereas no, I was going to say, it's... Disturbed and Simon and Garfunkel are fucking two totally separate but it, animals. It sound, but here's the thing, it sounds the same. Eh. eh the only really. difference is, uh, I forgot, I know, his, I know his first, I know his first name's David, I forgot his last name, but David, the lead singer of Disturbed, has such a distinct and Which amazing one? voice. Which singer? There was two. There's been two different ones. Two different singers for Disturbed. Pretty sure. No. No. It's oh, only wait, been the one. Am I thinking of? You think? You think? Uh, Kill Switch has had several. Kill Switch. Several lead that's what singers. I'm thinking, of. I'm thinking of Kill Switch. You're right. Yep, that's the one. Yeah, I was thinking of Kill Switch. They've had a couple different ones, but they almost sounded identical. Yeah, yeah they had like the white uh, guy and then they had a black guy afterwards, and like he sounded almost identical. Yeah, they really they sounded weird. pretty identical. Yeah. Like you could still hear the difference, but they sounded almost the same. Yeah, it wasn't like a crazy difference by any means. But yeah. This is making me nervous because I don't know if there's any more guys still. Left. I think I might have. Just seen somebody down on that lower path there, down those stairs. Yep, yep there he is. There he is. I thought, oh, yep, there's one. Oh, there's three. Yep, two running. Yep, there's the third one. Four. They'll say four guys. Somebody's shooting from a higher up. It seems. It might. It might be the building there or the one across the street from it. 
It's either the one right in front of that, like, penis-shaped one, or the one to the left of it. The penis ship. Okay. <laughs> you that, know exactly. This, this thing? Yeah. Yeah, the one that looks like a dick. It's either the one that's right below it, the house that's right below it right there, the uh, one. I, you said that, and I was like, that's a perfect stop there, sniper, so I was taking a look. There he is. Yep. Okay. That's where I thought he was. I knew he was either there or across the street. Yeah. But... Yeah, no, I mean, like I said, covers can be just as good, you know, and sometimes they can be better, but... but uh, the, the genre thing you were speaking of, like, uh... I think the, that the plays be a big The part. Beatles and Aerosmith are the same genre, yes. just from different yeah. points in time. Absolutely. That's And that's my point, is, you know, a, so that's a, why. the evolution of genre. Yeah. No, exactly, and that's why I feel like they're kind of in a slightly different... That's a different category for me, whereas, you know, like I said, Simon and Garfunkel and then, you know, them is, like, totally different. What? I I'm gonna be honest, I haven't heard much from Simon and Garfunkel. What genre are they? Folk. Yeah, folk? they're folk. Oh, okay. Yeah, they're folk. I'm not... I don't like folk. They're folk no. as fuck. Yeah, they are. But... These guys need to stop moving around. Like, for instance, like, a cover I really enjoy, but, you know, I still... It still doesn't beat the original is, um... Have you heard the cover that uh, 21 Pilots did for Cancer from my chem? Yeah, I love that. Version. Like, it's a beautiful cover. Different genre. Completely different genre. Not Does really. Not, it, it it's, is, it's not at all the same. The difference is that... But they, I like it because they made it their own. The biggest difference between those two that, you know, it's I wouldn't say it's a different genre. They're definitely in the same genre because 21 Pilots was heavily inspired by my chem in general. Uh, they're a huge influence for them. But the biggest difference between those two is that you it's two different emotions at the way they're looking at this like you know i'm dying of cancer thing where it's like my chem is like hey this is happening but you know Ooh. you know it's it's okay pulled that shot out of my ass whereas the the 21 pilots cover it's far more emotional yeah it really feels like he's like he's like you know like this is terrible but i don't want you to know that i'm you know i feel this way i, wa I don't want you to experience it which, I mean, you know, obviously is, like, the kind of the thing in both of them, but I feel like the 21 Pilots one does a little more... It really hits that more emotional point, just because of, well, like... Well, they're very, they're also very an emotional band. That, yeah. That's that's basically well, again, what, the, so is, that's what they're based off of, is emotion. Well, and again, so is MyChem, and I think the biggest difference between the two, though, is that MyChem is more like, I'm sad, so I'm gonna yell and be angry about it. <laughs> Which I and again, I'm not bashing my chem. I fucking love them. I have the tattoo on my fucking chest from Killjoys. Like I love them. Don't get me wrong, but they're like, uh, you know, they're angsty. Whereas Twenty One Pilots is like, man, I'm fucking sad, man. I'm gonna cry about and it, and I'm gonna tell you about it, and like be <laughs> super bummed, like you know. And once again, the way the same thing you said, the way I said it made it made me make it sound like they're pussies, and I'm like, no, I fucking oh, love no, 21 no. They're Pilots. Oh, no, no, they're both amazing bands. Like I love both of them, but yeah. It's Fuck, just, I make fun of myself for being a pussy. <laughs> I called myself a soft boy last week. <laughs> like, <laughs> but yeah, it's like, you know, they, there's there's definitely differences in them. Even though they're in the same genre, they approach it in a... In who? A, who? Who else? He's, he's up. He's up. He's up. He's up. He, he's not that way. He's behind you. Oh, wait. There is also a guy behind you, but there's also two What? Guys I was just over there. Where'd you guys come they from? They hiding, waiting. Holy watching, shit. Waiting, wishing, wanting. Do it. Wish it. Want it. Take it. Whatever Brian's book is called. <laughs> Wish uh, it, want it, do it. Yeah, that's the one. Or some shit like that. No, I think that's right. Um, or, yeah, because I remember in the episode, it's like, like, I guess they wish it and want it the same thing. Kind of the thing. same thing, yeah. <laughs> <clears throat> but, yeah, so, I don't know. I feel like, I, like I said, covers covers can be just as good, God. but I, I have Fuck. a hard time Fuck. ever Fuck. saying a cover is better. Oh, okay. I usually shit. say a cover is better, but I do have a handful of songs where I genuinely Of course, yeah, like you said, I mean, you know, or like, you know, going back to the whole Simon and Garfunkel thing. If you're not into folk, of course you're not going to really enjoy the... I felt like that was, like, right in my face. Yeah, yours needs to be closer to you than me anyways, though, because fucking quiet as a bitch. Unless I'm yelling. Yeah, well. <laughs> See, if I'm talking normal, it's like I got a quiet voice. Oh, that's my knee. <laughs> now you're fine. If I'm talking normal, I got a very quiet voice, but, like, when I get pissed off, it's, like, deafening. There we go, how's that? Is that good? You happy now? Oh, thanks, Dad. There you go. You don't have a neck anymore, but that's fine. You didn't need it. You're not using that neck. Do they have the little fucking logo on their uh, hatties? Like on the on the white spots? Do they have the little like the star? The star, hammer, and sickle. I uh, but I saw the star. If they've got the star, Devin, uh, could you do me a flavor and shoot one right through the star, please? 
I'd really appreciate that if you could do that for me. Okay, I don't think there's another Russian left. I think that was the last one I shot. Dude, what the fuck, Devin? I mean, I, you know, I don't ask much of you, do I? I have done everything you have asked me of in this game. Yeah, you, you wanted me to shoot him in the dick, so I shot him in the dick. Yeah, yeah, you did. You sure did, boy. So, uh, you want a specific way for that guy to die? Uh, there, there was a sniper another? somewhere. He might, uh, is he up? Yeah, there's, uh, there's a lot of open spots right here. There oh, he yep. is. Yeah, there you are. He bald. He's bald. Yeah, I think he's bald. <laughs> that's, that's exactly what the reflection was. I was going to say, it wasn't, it wasn't the gun. It was his bald ass head. Ooh. Oh, my God. You shot Ben Grimm. <laughs> <laughs> Fucking the thing. No. <laughs> Susan's going to be so sad. Her uh, brother. Damn, we're pretty far into this. Yeah, I was going to say, probably we, uh, probably wipe, wipe out these guys and then we'll call an episode. Because I don't think we had too much time at the beginning of this before we actually started recording. I know a guy ran down here. Where? Seems like there's somebody else as well, though. Yeah, no, there's two people. There's, there's a oh, guy. there's one. There's a guy. Oh, oh there's, there's a... there. Okay. Or is there a third I one? I saw. I saw the guy run down those stairs, and I couldn't see Maybe him. Maybe he ran back around. He's fucking doing laps. Shoot him in the knee. Take an arrow to the knee. Ah! Ah! <laughs> ah! <laughs> yeah, you having fun there? Oh, maybe there was a third person. There we go. Yeah. Ugh, didn't last. Ah! <laughs> <laughs> Fuck. Ah! Oh! Oh! oh. oh. <laughs> I'm gonna like set my ringtone to be the Wilhelm scream. <laughs> <laughs> Just every time somebody calls me. Ah! That was a brutal hit. All right, yeah, I think was... the area is clear now. All right, cool, cool. So next time we'll uh, proceed on to that uh, yellow marker. Is that which way? Is, is that going down that way, or in that building? I think it's in the building. I don't even see the. Oh, there it is. Mm, I think it's in the building. I think we have to go through it, maybe. Yeah, well, we're gonna go in that general direction. All right, we'll figure it out next time. Goodbye. Bye. Insert Wilhelm screen here.